Hello Collective and welcome back to my channel Luma Moon Tarot. So everybody I am here doing a random reading for you. This reading is for the collective so it may not resonate with all of you. Okay just take what resonates leave the rest you know don't try to force it and thank you everyone for all of your support the likes subscribes all of my subscribers thank you thank you thank you everybody new here thank you very much and welcome all right so divine what do you have for my collective today messages for the collective oh boy oh <laughs> all right so what I'm seeing here right off the bat is that the divine is telling somebody it is time. It's time to come in with the truth. It's time to drop these burdens. This person's been carrying the burdens knowing that they need to communicate with you for a very long time. They've been, I feel like they've been avoiding the situation, just keeping their back turned. They've been ignoring it, okay? Um, the divine has been wanting this person to choose a new path. Uh, but they've been standing here for years. I feel like it could be, well, it could be months, but I'm feeling like it's years. And it's time for this person to drop those burdens now and communicate, okay? Um, yeah, that's what I'm feeling like here. They need to choose a path. They need to do something. They can't just keep their back turned on this. Um, Queen of Pentacles, yeah this person i feel like they put you in the in a third party situation here yeah and they know they need to come forward or they're going to be in a lot of regret because this person really wants you i feel like they want to get back together here collective you could have been the one um for this person here they know they missed out on the one for them they're missing out on the one for them and i feel like it's been because they've been stubborn They've been acting like a baby here. Um, it's kept them out of the cold. The longer that this goes on, the the worse their situation gets, okay? They could be asking others about you, or if this person is in another commitment with someone else, they may be trying to figure out how they're going to get a divorce. And this could take a while, and the divine is like, you don't have that kind of time left. It's time to talk. It's time to come out with your truth. Um, yeah, this person could be having a lot of, like, this is financial hardships here. Um, they could lose a home. They could lose a job. They're losing their health. Their health is dwindling over this the longer they stay in it. Uh, it's a third-party betrayal, heartbreaking situation, you know. I feel like they broke your heart. They betrayed you, and they need to make something right. And this person's been avoiding it. They've been ignoring this, keeping their back turned for far too long. The divine's not having it anymore. Uh, they're in a lot of regret. I just get the feeling like the divine is telling them, you're moving too slow. You're moving too slow on making things right. Scared or not, if you don't come forward, you're going to be in a lot of regret because you're going to miss out on your opportunity with the one for you. Okay, clarify this Three of Pentacles and Justice. Yeah, they're, they're looking into my, maybe their finances. I feel like this person, uh, they're watching something or learning about something or doing their work on something here. They're, you know, here's the thing. They're going to walk away from someone else. But I feel like they're meeting with somebody, um, maybe even... Uh, working with someone to try to figure out how to get a divorce without losing everything that they've invested, okay? They're going to lose a lot here. How do they get out of it without paying alimony? How do they get out of this marriage without paying anything? I, I kind of get the sense that they're worried about their money here. They're worried about all that they've worked for. They know there's a, a divorce coming up. They know they're walking away from something here, okay? I feel like this person's worried that they're, that, yeah, look, that's all that they worked for. I'm telling you. They're, they want to leave it all behind, but this person is very worried about losing um, their money, losing, it could even be a business, okay? They, if they have to get a divorce, they could lose a business. They could lose 
their savings. They could lose everything that they've everything they've been working on here. And this person, I feel like they're they may even be asking like a getting with the legal team, right? How do I break free without losing it all? Yeah, I feel like because they're in love with you, you could be dealing. Yeah, they want this new love with you. They want to commit to you instead. You could be dealing with the water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I've got some Libra out here, but I feel like this is legal legal advice that they're looking into, okay? This person's looking into legal advice. And uh, yeah, you could be dealing with the Virgo as well. They want this new beginning with you. They want this Ten of Pentacles with you. They know you're the one that they want, and they're going to lose you if they don't act on this now. There's no time left. The Wheel of Fortune is out here. The Divine is saying, here's a sword, pal. Speak your truth. It's time. It's time. Clarify this Three of Cups. Why is the Three of Cups here? Oh... I feel like um, whoever they're currently with uh, may have somebody else in the picture already. They've got a Knight of Wands. I feel like this is them. They've got uh, whoever they're currently with is already cheating on them with someone else. I feel like this person's going to find out. They don't want. They haven't been wanting to see any of this. They haven't been wanting to deal with their conscience. They haven't been wanting to accept responsibility. They, I, they may feel stuck here um, in a situation that's now a third party. Um, I feel like they created a third party with you, but whoever they're with, I feel, is, is, has somebody new. And they're going to see this. They may even witness this, or they may already know about it. Ah, that's what it is. They're waiting to find this out because I feel like this person's gotten some kind of tarot card readings. They're finding out that whoever they chose over you has a new option, okay? And the one that they left behind is their actual twin flame. Yeah, I feel like this person, yeah, I feel like they are, um, they're finding this out through tarot. They're not confronting the situation yet because they feel like they want to bust whoever they're with. Um, they want to make sure that they get the proof, you know, that there's cheating going on behind the scenes. But I think they already know it. I think they've felt it before and they've just ignored everything about the situation. Yeah. As, I feel like as soon as they find out the truth or see it, you know, go down here with the with the Knight of Wands and whoever they're currently with, they're going to come straight to you. But they're still worried about the divorce, the money, everything. But they're waiting to find out. They're waiting to see proof of somebody cheating, okay? And collective, I feel like this is you. This is your energy. You are about to get, wow, Oh, collective, this is you. You're about to get somebody new here. Um, you could be a Virgo, Leo, Leo Aries, Sagittarius, maybe a Gemini. I feel like you could even be a Cancer, Pisces energy here. Um, I feel like you're very abundant. You, you're possibly a business owner, boss, or you've worked really hard on your stability, okay? Because now you're in the Nine of Pentacles energy and you're single right now. You're out here as a treasure. And I feel like this person, they're out of time because you know what? They're still waiting for proof that they're being cheated on someplace else. But in the meantime, you have somebody new coming in that's just going to choose you. This new person, I feel like, um, and they could be finding this out through tarot, okay? Uh, because this is telling me that... Um, Everything is being exposed, okay? So this tarot card reader could be telling them this. But this new person coming in is going to make you very happy. It's going to lead to your Ten of Cups. It's going to be a very passionate new beginning for you. 
I mean, this is a happy, happy wife, happy life, happy family, beautiful home, um, emotional fulfillment for the rest of your days. You're about to be loved the right way. And this person, I feel like they're being told this from a reader. Or they're watching tarot card readings out here on YouTube, maybe. And the reader is saying this exact thing. Buddy, you're about to be cheated on. Whoever you're with um, has another option and uh, their friends even know about it, but you don't. And over here, you've got uh, your twin flame, your divine feminine, who is about to be snatched up by somebody else. So you really don't have time left. You need to pick up this sword and communicate. I mean, this person's like, oh, my gosh, what am I going to do, right? That, I mean, they're finding out this information here. And I feel like the one that they want is getting away. You're, you could be um, uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, taking control of your own life, looking into your future, looking forward to better days. Um, yeah, I feel like this person's about to lose it all, and they were informed of that by a reader, and now they're kind of like falling apart. They're a mess. This person can't sleep. The thoughts of this are haunting them. Yeah, they're finding out the truth here, man, and I feel like they're going to very quickly find out that the person that they're with was probably in it just for money. Um, I feel like they felt very betrayed here, and I feel like they've been cheating on this person. They could be dealing with an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, maybe a Capricorn. And I feel like this Queen of Swords, they're going to find out the truth. This Queen of Swords here, whoever they chose over you, I feel like they're um, a toxic individual, a karmic, but they in fact are having a new beginning with somebody else. And they're going to be in your person's kind of, they're, they're, I feel like they're going to throw it in your person's face, I have to say. And they're going to be like, ha, huh, it's kind of like a, I'm doing this because I feel betrayed by you. I feel like manipulation here. This person, everything is starting to fall apart for this person and they're, they're losing it all. Um, they're finding out all of this truth here through tarot. Things are starting to actually happen the way the tarot card reader said. I mean, you know, um, if it's out here on YouTube, I got to say any, any tarot reader, a good tarot reader, it's about receiving messages from the divine and delivering them the best way that we can. And I mean, these are messages from the divine. This is the divine's hand. This is the universe speaking. Okay. So, yeah, somebody here is getting new love. This person's got, man, clarify this. This could also be manipulative love bombing, all right? I just feel like this person is realizing, they're realizing somebody has someone else or you're about to meet someone else, okay? Yeah, this is a full realization here. Bing, a light bulb goes on. They realize it. Look at them. They're sitting here crying. Yeah, you're moving on and um, you're moving on. And I feel like you're doing great without this person. And I feel like this Queen of Swords over here has met someone new. I feel like this person's going to do everything that they can um, to come in and at least try to talk to you here because they're coming towards you. But um, you, <laughs> it's kind of like it feels like a panic situation. Like where do they go? They, they got nowhere to go. You're, you're moving forward. You're about to get new love. Um, it's crumbling wherever, with whoever this person chose over you. Um, yeah, all they can do, they're going to do all that they can, but I feel like it may feel like love bombing, but the, I feel like this person's about to take some kind of action here. King of Wands energy, um, you could be dealing with the Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. I've got Virgo, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aries, um, yeah, Pisces, Scorpio. Okay, what else can you show me? Yeah, I feel like here they come. 
here they come. I feel like somebody also too, it just feels like the, like a connection is being severed and they're coming towards you collective to talk and do everything that they can to get you back. This is like a, please, please, I love you. I don't want you to leave, right? They're going to lay it on thick. Okay, but you are about to get this communication. They may even bring you a gift or other people may tell you about what's going on in the background. But I feel like this is your person taking action, coming in, cutting something out. They're going to have an argument with this Queen of Swords over here, I feel. They're still very, here's the thing. They come towards you, but I really sense that this person is still focused on the cheating and the betrayal of this other this queen of swords this toxic situation because they're coming towards you but they're still looking over here so this person i feel like they need to heal before they come towards you but they are being told they don't have any time left so i kind of feel like they're not quite ready yet i have to say it but they're coming in anyway but they're too focused on the bad things that have happened to them and they may come in talking to you about this stuff. And you're going to know that they're just not over something yet. Okay? And that may, that it's, it may just help you move forward. Okay? Right now, you're in a happy place all on your own. You don't need anybody in the energy that you're in. You're already detaching and moving on. And this person comes in to talk to you and love bomb you, but they end up focusing on what just happened to them in the other situation. That's not good. That's not good. You're going to notice that right away, I think. Okay. And you have new love coming in that's going to take you to your ultimate wish fulfillment. Anyway, collective, that's what I've got for this reading. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. Um, if you like this video, please hit that like button, right? Subscribe to my channel if you like this vibe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.